All right, you guys have been asking for this mod for so long, and I felt like it was finally time to give it a try. This is After the End, which takes place in 2666 in North and South America. So you have a bunch of bookmarks here, and it's really interesting. Apparently, it's based off of, I think, the Canticle or the, yeah, the Canticle of Leibowitz or for Leibowitz. I can't remember. I've read the book, so I feel embarrassed that I don't remember. But basically, this is like if the world had returned to like feudalism and like those early days, like look at this, got this little like gladiatorial battle, which is very beautifully rendered. So basically, as you can see the map here, it goes all the way up to Svalbard, um, which is technically, I think part of Norway in real life, but I guess it's North America, which I didn't know that. And I love the little accents here on the map of the, the polar bears and this, this person fishing over in Greenland, but you have all the way down to South America Brazil obviously being the largest one over here, but it's really, really interesting. Um, you got a lot of cool stuff here in the Caribbean. I'm debating on who to play as now because I have a few options. So I've lived all over the US. I'm obviously from the US. Um, my dog is actually named Kenai because I used to live in Alaska in the Kenai Peninsula in Anchorage specifically. And so I thought about that and I thought about maybe the desert, like the saguaro, because I've lived here in Arizona. Oh my god, wait, do they worship? Oh my god, they worship they worship aliens. That's so cool. But there's also some really cool stuff like down here in Florida, like the possibility of of, you know, you reuniting Florida. There's like a there's like a pirate, I think. Yeah, this Gaspar guy who is literally a pirate. He's a nautical faith. There's just so much Allegheny, because I actually live in western Pennsylvania. So this one's really funny that Yinzik is a culture. So just a lot of cool stuff. It looks like Pittsburgh is here. And I'm going to do this one. I'm actually, this is where I currently live in Allegheny. So I'm going to do Tycoonus Philippa II of Allegheny and see if I can maybe try to conquer the Rust Belt here. I don't know, like go along this way, try to take over all the Galvanists. I feel like that would be good. Obviously destroy as much of Ohio as humanly possible. And then we'll go from there. So I'm going to hit start. This is obviously very new to me. There we go. Oh, my son. I do have a son. Tycoon Marshall of Allegheny. So we're called tycoons. That's very interesting. Also, very nice. I have a high intrigue. This is my dad, lead engineer Dolly of Allegheny. Let's see if I can get us some nice alliances here to start off with. But uh, before we do that, this is, I just, I just want to say this is such already House Moreau, Spirit of the Bison, Grandsus family. Okay. I really wish there were there were texts for like the Yinziks. Let's see what sort of decisions we have. All right, construct a grand temple, demolish a holy, demolish. Form the kingdom of Keystone. So I have to control this and I have to control this, which I believe, uh, so I have to control the Delaware Valley and I have to control this. I am not nearly strong enough to take them on. Let's see. Cause that would be a good one to do for this one. Yeah, I'd have to take that and that, which I think, oh, it's inside of the Chesapeake, oh, I see, because it's the former borders of Pennsylvania. Before the event that lands between the serene shores of Erie Lake and the city of Philadelphia were united under a single majestic banner. Let us unite these disparate lands once again. You get the kingdom of Keystone and the nickname the Reformer. All right, join a Titans union. According to the Codex of Regulations, it is a sacred obligation for every adult Galvanist to join a union. What? <laughs> okay. They're dedicated to individual Titans, emphasizing their individual regulations and ideas. Let me see. What? There are many unions, each dedicated to a specific Titan and the regulations. While all regulations are important, it is still required to devote your time to the labors of a single union. By joining a union, I would also be joining a community filled with like-minded devotees. Collectively, our laborers will be used to strengthen industry far more than our individual actions may accomplish. Whatever blessing this union may bring to me, being with similar Galvanists can only bring me health, wealth, and glory. But the question remains, which one calls to me? So we got the Union of Steel Drivers, Union of the Protector, Union of Libraries, Union of Prosperity, Union of Songsmiths, and... That is it. All right, let's see. Titan Rockefeller. Titan Carnegie, I feel like, is the one we should do because Carnegie, obviously famous in Pittsburgh. Ah, oh, the Rockefellers, though, is a really good one. Popular opinion would be minus two. Having that extra money could be good. I mean, how old am I? I'm 28. You need another protector. Oh, Titan OSHA. No. Wow. All right, I'm doing OSHA. I'm sorry. I have to. That's, that is so, that is so funny. 
Wow, this is really good so far. I love her hair. Just beautiful, beautiful hair. I love the the map too. I like that it's got turned on its side. I think that's actually a really clever way to to sort of unfamiliarize unfamiliarize the player with it. Plus, it gives it the same sort of feel as like the base game. We have that like long stretching continent. Um, I can hold court, of course. And create the Duchy of the Wilds, which I cannot actually. I should grant the Enterprise of Shenango to somebody. I'm not calling a fort position. Oh, what do we have here? So we have pikemen, light horsemen. Okay, so there's no unique men in arms. That's good to know. Because I was curious about that if there was going to be like, you know, Butler. Wow, in Greensburg. That's so funny. That is wild to me. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So Greensburg is technically our capital. Oh, it's because I don't have Pittsburgh. I have Greensburg, which is actually very odd that I wouldn't have Pittsburgh as my capital. Considering, what is the, oh, I see, this is interesting. I would love it if there was a unique building like the Steel Tower or something. All right, so I have my faith. I've chosen Union of the Protector. What else is there to do before we start? My sons need wives. I'm gonna marry with the Monongahela's and that'll be the first thing that we do. Although he's pretty old. Should I marry my other son to them? Because I have two. One of them should definitely marry them though. Yeah, there we go. You should be getting, let's do, let's do industry. Let's do, pensive children often do well. Is he pensive? Oh, he is pensive. Oh, 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 that's my other son. What is your focus? Oh, your focus is also stewardship. That's not a problem. And making a lot of money isn't isn't bad. I can exchange, designate a guardian for my son. Do they both have spouses now? No. You do, but you do not. So we need to make one more. And where is this? It's a bad lander. It's a little too far. The Buckeyes. Yeah, that's the one we'll do. We'll do this one. Okay, so the Moreau's. Very, very cool. All right, we're getting ready to hit go here. I'm just checking to make sure there's nothing else that I'm not seeing. The court is the same, obviously. I'm sure over time they'll change that, but very cool so far. So, all right. So we've got some decent alliances. We're pretty strong as far as that goes. Let me check on... Hmm. Oh, I think my dad can get married to somebody as well, and that could also grant us a nice alliance. Let's see. Yes. But let's marry him to somebody appropriately aged. Although that's 1800. I mean, 1800's gonna 1800, you know what I'm saying? Empire of the Steel Belt. Should I try to make the Steel Belt, or should I go the other way? That's the, that's the question now. But I don't have anything on them, so I feel like what I should do... Less than faithful. We're still pretty low. We should do Altoona, I think. Let's do Altoona here. And I should be able to call in my allies from Monongahela and Miami Valley. This is so funny to me. Oh, interesting you gotta pass this big Appalachian Pass here, which is actually is good for them. Makes it pretty difficult for me to get around. Got a nice 200 gold. I should increase something. I should build some. Hill forts would make sense, but I'm gonna do, let's see, what would make the most sense? I'm gonna do a blacksmith. We're an industrious people, right? So naturally I think we would build blacksmiths. All right, I'm gonna get everybody over here. I should probably have them combine. Cool, that's 1900. I can turn around and punch him in the mouth here in a second. If we can get this early victory, I'm really wanting to make the the kings the kingdom of Keystone. I would definitely if somebody if this goes well, I would love to do a Florida run. That just sounds like the mouse being one kills me. That is amazing. Also, we haven't read what galvanism is, but we're gonna do that here in a second. I won't. I'm not gonna read it right now while the war is going on, but we will certainly do that. The perspective is throwing me off. Like I keep wanting to tilt the map. Even though I shouldn't. 
But the presidency is what this is called. Look at them drip! Bro! They look so sick. E plur. Oh my god. E pluribus unum. That is so dope, dude. Engineer Coleman of Detroit is my ally. Oh, I didn't realize I was allied to Detroit specifically. That makes sense. I feel like that's fair. I feel like we should be. I feel like Detroit and Pittsburgh have similar chips on their shoulder from a lifetime of, of harshness, really. What a beautiful time this is already. I'm enjoying myself. Um, I feel like I should just keep trying to swallow up as much land as possible in the in the ways of the ancestors of old. The old tycoons long past. This should win us it. Oh, it didn't. Not a single hostage either. That's interesting. Let's get them capture them in just in case they get somebody. They did not. Okay. All right. So we got new land, we got Altoona, which I think belongs to me. Yep, just me. And I will do this. And I think... He's still working on that, I'm not gonna do that yet. How long is that Do we have a truce with you still? Okay, we do. We do, we do, we do, we do, we do, we do. Do I wanna, do I wanna go to the county of Susquehanna? Do I wanna do that? What is my government, technically? We're a feudal kingdom. Okay, so we are feudal. I want to read Galvanist now. For the Galvanist, the best way to restore industry and usher in the new Gilded Age, oof, is by strictly adhering to the rituals and regulations passed down from the Titans. The engineers of the Galvanizing Assembly have scoured through ancient texts to figure out these rituals and have spent the ensuing centuries debating exactly how to uphold them. All of this has been recorded in the Codex of Regulations, leaving the Galvanist with an expansive legalistic... Yeah, legalistic code covering every aspect of life instruction for countless sacred animals. Oh my god. The Codex of Regulations is the Galvanist holy text compiled by centuries of engineers. It has five principal parts. The regulations themselves, the commentaries, and three appendices. The regulations are the words and teachings of the Titans, which we've talked about, and occasionally industry itself. They are always written in blood red ink. Holy f Surrounding these regulations are the com commentaries and teachings from the various meetings of the Galvanizing Assembly. The first appendices contains stories from various engineers not pertaining to any specific regulations but general stores from their lives offering insight and advice the second appendices covers the marvels of industry filled with details and schematics and engineers best guesses on how they might have worked oh so they don't know of course the third appendices covers the stories of the various titans titans being emerging from humble origins as mortal men and women these extraordinary individuals have ascended to the realm of the gods through their unwavering dedication and exceptional abilities bestowing upon them by industry. While possessing considerable power, the, cap the capabilities of these gods are often shaped by their previous mortal endeavors, mirroring the ways in which they served industry in their mortal lives. The practices and rituals of these faiths draw heavily from the lives and teachings of these revered titans, providing guidance and inspiration to their followers. I want to see what the Gilded Age, what that is supposedly, hold on. Stands as a remarkable era characterized by the abundant prosperity with industry reaching its zenith. Oh, wow. Yep, that's fair. Titans. Uh, society operated as a well-coordinated mechanism with individuals working in perfect synergy for the collective assembly during this period. During this period, the aspiration to attain godhood as a titan was within reach for anyone willing to exert diligent effort. Nonetheless, even for those who didn't achieve such status, life was comfortable and prosperous. Oh boy. And then what happened? Hold on, it keeps falling away from me. I'm sorry. However, they led comfort and prosperity that defined the era led to its downfall as people grew complacent and gradually abandoned the sacred rituals necessary to maintain industry's divine status. With industry rusting away and, oh my God, and once mighty society crumbled, giving rise to the transformed world we witness today. Occasionally, remnants and artifacts from that bygone time resurface, but their purpose and function remain shrouded in mystery. The vast chasm between the past and the present has confounded even the most eminent scholars, leaving them to speculate and conjecture about the true nature and significance of these relics. Wow. I am in love with this already. I gotta tell you right now. All right, I'm gonna fight it. Face me, you foul beast. What is it? A clear trail of blood. I gained the title Hunter... And I killed a monster and gained 350 prestige. So pretty freaking solid, I got to say. Um, how soon is that? Okay, we got a little while. So we're going to fight in this war for, it looks like the top of, for up north <laughs> in Michigan. Uh, Marquette. Oh, Beaver Island. Yeah, that's cool. Hell yeah. 
Yeah, I'm originally from this area. So seeing this and seeing that they have like a Pope, specifically the North Shore. Waukegan? No way. Woodstock. Wow, Racine up in Wisconsin. Yeah, I'm from that area, so that's very, very cool to see that on this map. <laughs> All right, we got Bloomeries. I gotta get over there. Oh, it looks like he's gonna win it though without me. Never fear though, the cavalry of Allegheny has come. I can ask my head of faith for gold. Sure, I'll do that. Thank you, Chief Engineer. I would worship this. I would do that. I would worship this so hard. This only makes sense that you would have hill forts. It's literally, this area is all hilly. This is like this, the, the eastern, no, uh, western edge of the uh, Appalachian Mountains. So, as you can see by this weird topography that you have to cross over. Oh no, I'm pregnant. Why is my husband so sad? What is our succession? Oh, it's partition. Oh, I see. Oh, I took his air. Very nice. Who did we lose? Within the lands I hold, there exist grand buildings dedicated to gods and prophets that we Galvanists do not recognize as sacred, something that more devout engineers constantly remind me of. While I could leave such sites alone, perhaps it is better I demonstrate my faith in the industrial force by demolishing one alongside gaining access to the raw materials that make up these sacred buildings. Pittsburgh is a holy site. So, what is theirs? Oh, Allentown in Philadelphia. Oh my god, I have to get over there then. My claims? Why do I have claim on that? Actually, can I can I fight that only war? No, I still don't have it for Duchy. We're very close to Faithful, though. I'd be able to take that then. So I might do this just to get some extra. Call in some extra dudes. Hopefully this works out for me. Call in you. Call in you. Call in you. Okay, well, that's probably for the best. I didn't realize I was going to lose my territory. Not that it really matters. Recruit Hill Specialist might be useful. Sustainablist. Interesting. So they like, they worship sustainability. Oh, there's so much depth to this. I cannot even fathom how much there must be to this mod. And this is in beta, by the way. I haven't said that yet, but this is still in beta. All of that you're seeing right here. So what? anything that you're like, wow, this is so impressive. It's, there's still more to be done. Which oh, great. I had a stroke. God, dude, I fucking hate, I hate that system so much. All right. Cool. Again, the trade as as the industry must continue. My mother, properly as she should have done, sacrificed herself for the good of the realm. And now we may march. The progress may continue in her name. Amen. And I am still a child too, so hopefully I don't get an entrenched regency. I can negotiate an alliance with my brother, who is apparently within my realm. He's a vassal, so I didn't actually lose any territory. But I did, I do have weakened this. I think I have more troops actually now. I do, okay. So let's do this. Let's fix Altoona first. Finish trying to get the county of Lancaster. We could probably also, I don't actually know if I have those alliances anymore than I think about it. Do I still have them? I mean, I'm with this one, but he's allied to them. And that won't pay off until he's what? She's 15. Okay, so that'll go through soon. He's not loyal enough to consent to being married off. He's situationally loyal. <laughs> of course. Union of Steel Drivers? I want to do that. I think that would be what he would do. Oh, he was right. Right, 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 right. He was a... He was stewardship focused. That's right. We'll do Domain. 
So he's got 20 stewardship. I should have picked a different union. I didn't even realize. I was I, I had the wrong one. The new culture head of the Inzix. Dude, hell yeah. And we're married. Of course, who pays for their own wedding? You want me to disrespect the ancient gods? I have a lot of holy wars that I can do, but I really only want to make that that one thing. So, is that New York City? Oh my God! Look, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold the phone. What? That is such a beautiful model, guys. That's beautiful. I wish Pittsburgh had something unique. Oh, what about DC? Does it have something? Ooh, it does. Wow, 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 wow. That's really cool. I'm I'm just jazzed. Hell yeah. Really jazzed about that, gotta be honest with you. We could develop capital. Nice. Diligent planning paid off. Visit an orphanage? What? Why would I do that? I don't need to do that. I don't need to visit an orphanage, like, at all. I feel like I should do it. Okay. Consult the calendar of saints? You're joking me. Fortnite. Fortnite is definitely the name. Bro, you've got to be joking me. That is quite possibly one of the funniest things I've ever heard. Wait, New Philadelphia, where are you? Hell yeah, dude. Get a huge alliance with that. There it goes. We'll give these two to him. I don't need all those territories. I don't actually know if that was a good idea, but... Oh yeah, because I still have two. Okay, so he did not raid it. Oh, they raided Pittsburgh. Dang, my poor babies. My poor babies. Who who does this go to? Oh, it goes to me. I really want to move my capital there. Unless something happened to Pittsburgh. But it's a city, is it not? Yeah. Okay, so he's trying to take Lancaster. Oh, I already have a claim on that. I'll try to do this one then. Try to keep on getting claims. My counselor Leonard died from something. His internal injuries. Mm -hmm, sure. Why oh my? Let me see here now. Okay. So what would it take for me to take this? I would need to control. Oh, I need three of them. Oh man. That is very beneficial. What happened to your dad? He died from a seizure. Well, that's unfortunate. You know, he can't be helped, so. I'm very close to faithful. Yes. What do we need here? Mountaineers? I don't have money for... Well, I guess I could hire mercenary guards. I'll go to a hunt. Maybe it'll reduce my stress. No, keep looking. I just keep losing prestige. That poor dude is having the worst time. I'm losing prestige by the second. Oh, there we go. I gained 150. But I lost a big alliance there. Which sucks. Alright, okay. Come on. Oh, we lost it. I lost 93% stress. Or oh, no, I didn't. I could have. But I gained the trade Hunter now. 
Oh, you gave me a bad omen. I really want to fight you again. County of Lancaster. The Poconos. Do I want to get Harrisburg now? I feel like I could. But I'm going to wait. I'm going to try and wait till this recovers a little bit. I can't believe that dude in New Philadelphia died. What is this? The Old Dominion? Constitutionalists? I'm really curious. There's so many things I want to look at. But I don't want to spoil too much. I want to like really just soak in this, this one area. I really like the idea of the industrialists. I think that's really funny. New stewardship perk. All right. Let's do... Vassal tax contribution, increase that shit by 10%. I'm 23 years old. I am feeling fine, but I'm having a little bit of a time. I really, I need, I need complete control over this and the Delaware Valley. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna get it. The Iron Tongue language? What is the Iron Tongue? Is that my language? I'm gonna go on a hunt. Hopefully get some prestige gain. Oh, that person tried to lay with me. I gained 35. We failed. We didn't even, uh, did we even find anything? Okay. I'm not going to ask my head of faith for gold. I need that for the holy war that's about to happen. All right. The great holy war for the kingdom, for the duchy of this, which makes up this kingdom, which I believe is the duchy of Lower Susquehanna. Oh, yeah, let's do this. I don't mind going into the negative for this. By 150. Not actually that bad. Oh god, 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 oh god. Oh, Jesus, that's scary. Nice. No, I don't do it. Not even worth it now. I shouldn't even have him be doing that. Give him, do, go do Harrisburg. Shui kill? Shul, shuli kill? What does that say? What are these words you're saying to me? 13 months, 7 months. Oh, my daughter died. Why? She had gout? Oh no, I'm torrentially stressed. There we go. I'm no longer overwhelmed. I'm a confidant. What does that do? It doesn't even give you a penalty. It gives you a bonus to diplomacy. It's be 4 months on that. 3 months on this. Oh god, we have to hold this. Because then I can, then I can start pressing into um, the the what is it? Not the District of New York. Not the District of South Jersey. Which one is it? It's um the Keystone State, the Delaware Valley. This, yes, 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 yes. So it's you, which you're very small. I see. But they have an electorate. Ew, gross. Imagine elections. Jesus. Disgusting. Alright, it's over. Enforce demand. So be it. Disband. So we now control Reading, Coatesville, Lancaster, and Pottsville. I can usurp this duchy as well, which I think would give me access to taking this. I need 250 gold, though, which is nice. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. So now, I don't have a cast his belly on him, but that doesn't mean I can't have one, I won't have one for very long. I am going to fabricate a county on Philadelphia, which should be our capital probably. But what I'm gonna do actually. I think we should have the option to demolish a holding building, right?
Or am I wrong? Yeah, wait, there's one in Allentown. Ah. Uh, or is that just, like, not a thing that's really available? Because Lancaster, I definitely hold one. Okay. Yeah, I need to wait for this one, too. I'm not sure which one to do first. I'm not... Because if I get a... If I get a claim on the whole duchy, do I take the duchy or do I do this other one? That is that is now the question. I feel like I really am close to making this keystone. Were we allied? I could have swore we were allied. Is my player Aaron not married? Oh my god, I'm not... I haven't been marrying him. <gasps> I can marry you to the, to the Mickey the Mouse? To the Mickey the Mouse. Look at that. <laughs> Presidential... Elias of the, or President Elias of the Presidency from the Waltney House. Wow. Absolutely gorgeous. I can declare war on you. Ooh, for the District of Delaware. Actually, you know what? And how strong is he? I don't feel like he will. I don't feel like he will. Oh my god, do we need to move our capital here? Which one can I call you? Thanks, bud. Was that person naked? Don't demonetize me, YouTube. I'm sorry. All right, yep. Yeah, 4,500. I love their little outfits. The, the mix of the armor with the, the like, colonial era hats is just too, too good. I would love to see, um like a like a take on maybe like some super metal looking armor who am i missing is this a marshall magnate i see take their capital i can create this duchy which i don't have apparently did that kid die? Oh, no, he didn't die. He's still around. Doesn't matter. Disband, baby. Ah, oh, all right. So what would that be? Okay, so we're, we, I am in debt, but if I was going to go to war, would it be for both of them? Or could I... I wonder if I could do a holy war for that duchy. That's too bad. Call to war. You want me to fight? You want me to help the presidency? Okay. Am I defending? Oh my god. Oh boy. Holy Colombian Commonwealth? That's terrifying. Cutting cornerstones is nice. Costs less for everything. Let's see if he can get the whole thing, because I don't know if he, if he can. Oh wow, he's gonna give me 50 gold. Thanks, dude. Because if he can, yeah, he's inferior to mine. I do want this duchy, and I have a pretty serious alliance going on here. So I'm debating on if I should just go after it now or try to just do it by claims. Oh, my golden child gave me money. Wow, what a, what a good boy. Proud of you. This gives me plus, oh wow. And increases my garrison by two. I'm gonna do that. That sounds really solid. Sure. I wonder if it would let me go to war for both now. Speaker Vivian of Delaware Valley. She has a very interesting look to her, doesn't she? Okay. So I just need to take the Delaware Valley, and then I can take this as well. Or once I take this as well, I should be good to go. So that's what I'm kind of curious about now. Do I have to, I have to do them one at a time? See, that's the problem. I think I'm going to have to do this. And then maybe call in 
you and you. Probably could call in all three, to be honest with you. Siege of Philadelphia. That's such a such a metal name, honestly. There we go. All right. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. It is done. Wow, Lancaster has a serious fort size, dude. Are right, we getting 10 gold a turn? I really wish. She's pregnant it again. Yellow is an unlucky color for people of my birth. Blasphemous, dude. What are you talking about? Yellow is our color. You can't just... You can't just deny your people. Okay. Alright. This is the... Now this is where I'm thinking of. Okay. Do I split him even more or do I just take this bottom duchy? I would have to take the whole duchy. And he doesn't have really anybody. I could do this by myself, I think. I think he's the only old order. Yeah, it's just him. I'm gonna take that bottom one. You're gonna siege the one fort that has a 12 month turnaround? That seems like a terrible idea. I am going to get rid of some of these. I'll probably get rid of... And nice. I'm going to get rid of some of these. Some of all skills. This guy seems like he's really promising. Give him those. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Alright, we're making our way. We're gonna make the Keystone State if I have to die trying. I mean, I already had one person die trying, so. We lost Philadelphia. How big is this fucking fortress? It's only four. Oh my god, I took him. I took, I captured him. You joking me. Wow. That was actually really fortuitous. All right, now I feel like we should murder him. Although it's going to give me a super high stress. So now it's just going to take about five more years. And then we should be able to... Can I usurp his title? No. I can par pardon my master machinist. I am forgiving, so I suppose I will. Mint it with my own visage? Hell yeah, dude. The Holy War for what? County of the Poconos. Oh great, now I'm gonna have to fight Hudsonia and they're really strong. Well, no, I guess they're not. I feel like I need to change this word, the spirit of... There we go. The spirit of industry gives us family. That makes way more sense than whatever the hell it said before. Okay. So now I'm just waiting on this truce to end in four years, and then we can go to war. We have 3,500 troops. We're pretty much the strongest people in this region. Oh no. Did they take part of... Is the County of the Poconos part of this? I'm gonna have to go to war with them. God damn it. Three months, and then when this is over, we'll be able to take this, and we will be able to forge our, our kingdom. My dude is just stressing at all times, I swear to God. We could also work to make Philadelphia our realm capital, but I don't see why I would need to. Although, I don't, actually, it has a 4 level of 12 as well. 12. Lancaster has an 18, though. I don't know the lore of this world, but I assume that whatever happened, Lancaster was big. Ooh, Mayor August. I don't know why I said August like that, but I did. Thank you. Thank you for giving me Milford. No one has ever said those words. Let's see now. Hold on. The truce ends in 20 months. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. To acquire some well-earned funds. Which it's going to cost us a lot to make the Kingdom of Keystone. So. 
Nice. I'm no longer. Construct a grand temple. Oh, like a... But... With the sacred place of our faith are important in our own right, I can display my faith in the industrial force and set an example for all galvanists by constructing a grand temple. That seems a little... A little sacrilegious to me, you know what I'm saying? You need 700... You need a thousand prestige for that? Dang, dude. That's actually wild. Uh-huh. Let's do centralization. You shall find that who seeks. Hmm. I don't know what that means, but thank you for telling me. Oh, these give you stuff, don't they? Let's make this. That'll be a big one, because we can easily earn the money back. It's going to take way longer to get to a thousand prestige. Get out there, we're gonna we're gonna fight a wolf. Let's go. No extra bonuses really. That's kind of surprising. I ran away. <laughs> we've we've failed the hunt. Although I did get Oh boy. I did get some extra. I'm really close to being able to do that one. Three months. Oh, gotta hit go. Did he end up winning that war? No. Is he still fighting that? Kingdom of Florida. Yep. We've been playing for how long? 26 years. A lot has happened. And we can do it. Holy War for the Duchy of Coal Land. And I don't think I'll actually even need to call anybody else. Should just be able to get this done nice and quick. Oh, that's going to count as a double win, too. And that is going to do it. And I can actually ransom him, probably, and still get the win. Yep. Ah. Oh. I control it all. Now we just need to get 300 more prestige and 200 more gold. Which should not actually be very difficult. Uh, let's combine them, and then we'll break them up, and then we'll grant all of this to somebody who is worthy. Of Penn Hills? Oh my god, that's so funny. This guy's actually pretty solid. Popular figurehead. God, this is going so well. Alright, so we're nearly at the money limit. So what I need to do, honestly, honestly, I think I'm gonna call a hunt. I think I'm going to do it in here. I don't think we need that. I think what we'll do, we're going to do on this. And we're going to do it for recreation. We're going to get the 200. Because the 300 is really easy to get. And yeah. I'm going to desecrate the monument soon. All right, let's see what we're going to hunt. Roger's the best candidate. We're hunting a fox. Let's hunt something with some vim. Let's try to hunt a wolf. Alright, here we go. After we ride, here we go. Patience. Got it. Nice. Ah, uh, let's get home. This war has been going on for ten years, by the way. Thank the industrial force I can go inside again. Oh my god, that's really funny. Alright, let's do it. Before the event that lands between the serene shores of Erie Lake and the city of Philadelphia were united under a single majestic banner, the kingdom of Keystone is ours, the, the title of the Restorer is ours. There is no description for this. Virtue, liberty, and independence is going to be 
the name, and we have done it. We have made the Tycoon Ship of Keystone. And I'm very, very pleased with this. This was a lot of fun. Uh, I would I would definitely keep playing, um, but that was, that was all I had planned for this one. So I'm just slapping this on here at the end. I decided to move my capital because the war finally ended to Lancaster. So now it is properly uh, capitalized. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this sort of content, make sure you like, comment, subscribe as it lets me and YouTube know that you are interested in this sort of content and you'd like to see more of it. Thank you guys so much for suggesting after the end. So many of you, and I mean so many of you, told me to give this mod a try. And I had been sort of putting it off because I was like, eh, I don't know if I'd really be interested in that, but I can full-heartedly wholeheartedly wholeheartedly there you go say that i really really enjoyed it um as always i want to thank all of our members here they are i appreciate you guys so much i sometimes forget to put you guys here on these end of these videos if they're not like you know a war video or something but i do appreciate you guys and i try to remember to put it in the description if i do so but yes thank you so much if you'd like to join you can check out the tiers in the join tab but that's gonna be it for me this has been after the end and i would love to cover this mod more so if you like it please let me know and i will happily see you in the next one